Good evening everyone, I'm Dustin Lukey. The Seven Rivers Alliance and Competitive Wisconsin are teaming up to bring an early childhood care and education summit to our area. News 19's Joe Minnie joins us with the details. Joe, can you tell us a little bit more about what's going to be going on? Yeah, thanks Dustin. It's part of an initiative called Wisconsin Tomorrow, and this summit is a statewide effort focusing on the relationship child care plays into a sustainable workforce. Now, inviting local employers, government officials, community leaders, and child care stakeholders, this in-person and virtual summit will discuss options to develop early child care and educational programs to help parents who want to get back into the workforce. Now, according to the Seven Rivers Alliance, the Cooley region has a demand of roughly 6,000 child care slots going unfilled, which is impacting the available worker supply because they can't find quality day care. In Winona County, a couple years ago, they did a survey and uh, of the parents that responded to that to their survey, 30% of them said they were unable to work because they couldn't find available child care. That, that's a significant number of people. Now, summit discussions will look into how to help current child care providers fill their workforce needs, especially for a career field that is already underpaid and has been losing employees to higher wage jobs or ones with better benefits. And Dustin, this issue is multifaceted as the cost of daycare has been a challenge for parents too. La Crosse's Family and Children's Center says one week of daycare can run between $175 to $250 per week for yeah. one child. Certainly is an investment. Thank you, Joe. And the special summit will be held on April 14th at Western Technical College's campus. It's co-hosted by the UW La Crosse and Wisconsin Counties Association. We've got registration info if you're interested over on our news app and website.